Good afternoon. Right. My name is Angela McCarthy and this is my colleague Sally Matson. And your names are? Thibault. Mariana. Can I have your mark sheets please? Thank you. First of all we'd like to know something about you. Where are you from um, Thibault? I'm from France, exactly a little city, a little town in the southeast of France called Menton. Okay, and, um, and you, Mariana? I'm from Venezuela, from the capital, Caracas. Okay, and what do you like about living in Caracas? I like living in Caracas because it's a big city and you can do everything. You have lots of shops and places to go to have fun. And what about you, Tibo? I like living in Menton because it's near a lot of things, like uh, it's near Italy, five minutes uh, with a car, near Monaco, it's near a big city, Nice, and of course uh, I'm near the sea and the mountain, and because it's a quiet and a really beautiful city. Hmm. Um, Mariana, uh, do you like going to parties? Yeah, I do. Tell us about a good party you've been to. In England, here? Well, last Monday was good. There was lots of people there. All my friends were there, and it was good. Well, um, Thibaut, tell us about a day you've really enjoyed recently. Recently, it was a sunny day. Um, it was I don't know, Tuesday. We make uh, we made a barbecue on the park, and it was really funny because. Uh, we don't usually eat outside uh, when I was in England, so... <laughs> Do you prefer working on your own or with other people? I prefer working with other people because I think it's very, really important to have a social exchange and maybe it's more interesting to work with other people because we can have a different point of view, point of views, and I prefer also this because it's less boring. Um, what kind of work would you really like to do in the future, Mariana? Work? Um, I don't really know yet, but I would like to work with a big company, have big, be, uh, my own business, and have my own company, if it's possible. Um, Thibaut, do you like to plan your holidays carefully, or do you prefer to just go? I prefer just go because I find it more funny and when it's when all it's planned I find maybe it's a bit boring because you have planned all uh, you go here at this hour and there at this hour so. mm. and Mariana how much TV do you watch in a week well it, when it was in Venezuela I used to see like for four hours a week, but now in England, I haven't seen TV since I came here, eight months. Thank you. In this part of the test, I'm going to give each of you two photographs. I'd like you to talk about your photographs on your own for about a minute, and also to answer a short question about your partner's photographs. Thibaut, it's your turn first. Here are your photographs. They show people enjoying special moments in their lives. I'd like you to compare the photographs and say which of the people you think will remember this moment the longest. All right? All right. So on the first picture, we can see three people who are celebrating uh, their um, climbing mountain. So, um, and on the second photo, we can see um, a lot of students who are celebrating uh, their degree. So um, on those fo two photos we can say that's a, an achievement of something. On the first it's a physical a physical um, achievement and on the second one it's a metal achievement. But I think the second the second photo is the photo which the people will remember this moment the longest because it's an achievement of a long time and we normally you can have another day uh, like it. Thank you. Mariana, do you like doing dangerous things? No, I don't because I think I'm a quiet person. I don't like take risks because it feels very 
I don't know, I, I prefer to be quiet and care, take care of myself, not to be very da in danger. Thank you. Uh, now, Mariana, here are your photographs. They show people doing different activities in their free time. I'd like you to compare the photographs and say how much you think the people are enjoying these activities. All right. Well, in the first one, our three childs are playing a table game. I think they are enjoying it very much. It's a quite game to everyone in any age. In the second one, they are playing video games. It's n I think it's not a very social game because you are by your own and uh, TV. I think they are enjoying it very much as well, but I would prefer the first one because it's a more social activity. But I think they both are enjoying it very well. And, and the second one, they are our three of them, they are playing together uh, in a big TV and in the first one uh, they are enjoying it very much as well. Thank you. <laughs> Can I have the booklets? Thank you. Um, Thibaut, do you ever do activities like these? Since I'm in England I never had these uh, activities but when I um, was in France I used to play a lot of video games with my friends, so, and table games too, but uh, it's more when I was in my childhood. Mm. Thank you. Now, I'd like you to talk about something together for about three minutes. I'd like you to imagine that there's going to be a competition to find the city of the year. Here are some things the organisers are thinking about. First, Talk to each other about why these things are important to people in cities. Then decide which two are the most important. All right? All right, All right okay. So let's start with the first picture. We can see a primary school. I think it's very important in cities because uh, it's where you let your children to learn uh, their first lesson and how to live in a social life. The second one is like an hospital. It's very important in a city to have a very good hospital because if people get sick, you can go there and and have this, the safety that you are going to be okay because there are very good hospitals. Uh, it's important for a city. I think it's as important as a school. And the third one is uh, commercial place uh, it's important it's important for the for the people to have fun but I think it's not important as a school do you say I'm totally agree with you I think uh, the first picture uh, it's important to relax but after on the fourth on the fourth pictures we can see a cinema at my opinion I think it's really important because uh, you can see a lot of films and know about uh, different culture, different aspect of uh, of with the films, and also on the fifth picture we can see public transport, which is really important. What do you think about it? I think it, a good transport in the city is important because if it's a big city, you need to get to the other side of the to the city, it's important to have a transport going there. In the uh, mm, sixth picture, it's a park for young people. It's important because young people need to be to to have fun to to grow up with with a good fun, and it's important. But um, in the five, it's to do sports. It's important to people to win sports, but I think, what do you think is the most important for a city? The two pictures more important for a city, I think it's an hospital, a good hospital, because you always need to be safe and to have a... And the school? And the school, of course, because uh, 
It's yeah. always important to have uh, children yeah. well educated. Yeah, I think I agree with you. I think they are the most important thing for our city, the school and the hospitals, transports as well. But I think that's about the best choice. Thank you. Which city in the world do you think should win the competition? Um, it's a difficult question. Let me think about it to say. I uh, think in the cities I have been, I think London is a good choice. It's why? Because it has everything we we are looking for. A good good tube to to go everywhere. Uh, places to have fun. Places to be educated. Uh, universities, schools, I think it's a good city to to live. Yes, I agree with you because um, you have so different hobbies that you can have uh, in London. If you like uh, go out, you have so many club, nightclubs in, in, I don't remember the club, mm. in Seoul or in other young place. Hmm. Why do some people not like living in cities, Timo? At my opinion, I'm agree with those people because I don't like big cities. I prefer stay in a quiet place and, and because always you have some stress uh, when you live in a big city. You always take the underground after you go to your job and after you, you go back to your home and it's always the same thing uh, day by day. Mm. Do you agree, Mariana? No, I don't. I prefer to live in a big city because you have everything in in there and you don't have to move to other places to, to have fun or to to go to school. I, I prefer big cities than small towns. It's true that they, they are stressful, but I prefer it. Mm. Um, what do you think is the best age for living in a city? Well, my age, teenage, it's Why? the best because you enjoy your life most because you don't have um, most things to be be stressed about, and you can you, you only have to study, and it's your only business. You don't have to care about any anything else. I think it's the best. Mm. What age. do you think, Tibo? I'm agree with her because um, you have finished your childhood, your childhood, so, but still you are not an adult, and um, I think it's the best age to go to to live in a city because you can learn how to live alone well you can study or you can have a job get a job and learn more about um, living city how are city people different from country people i think City people are more stressed than the others. The other ones are more careless. They only want to be relaxed. They are more calmed. What do you think? As well, I think so. Mm, a part of people prefer live in a big city because there are a lot of things to do. And exactly what you said, some people just want to be quiet and to have some relaxing moment and to live uh, the life uh, as they want. Thank you. That's the end of the test.